of Excellence, CAW Entertainment. Welcome to another edition of Action. I am Lone Star, as always. We are about a week away from Ascendance. And we are getting ready with a women's match here. On Action. And that is Saifa Belnades, who is set to take on Lara Croft here. On this last stop before we get to Charlotte. Four ascendants. What the event ascendants is going to be? We will have the pre-show when we get there. We will know who will challenge for the SCW Championship at Blood, Sweat, and Tears. We'll know who the SCW Champion will be. And we'll know who Hellboy will be facing at Blood, Sweat, and Tears 11 once we get through with the sentence. Here it will be Sypha against Lara Croft. Who will be facing Sailor Moon at Ascendance. What a matchup that is going to be. Lara Croft is... A multi-time women's champion, one of the greatest female performers in SCW's history. Three-time former women's champion. It's about well, Sailor Moon has come into SCW and has been dominant, not having lost a match. But she will be facing her biggest challenge at Ascendance in Lara Croft. Be matches underway here. And Sci-Fi, a relatively newer comer, it's been around for about a year. Laura Croft, who's been around since, what, 2010 for SCAW. Won her first women's championship in 2012. In Spring Showdown. Became a two-time champion later that year. Won her third women's championship in 2013, 2015, excuse me, against Jill Valentine. In a brutal, actually, cry was 2016, excuse me. That's a splash right there. I remember because it was reckless randomness. It doesn't take place in 2015. It was in 2016. ladder match. Saifa has it's even challenged for that title, but nonetheless her experience certainly has a shot at winning this. Lara Croft could be looking past Saifa here into a match with Sailor Moon taking place at Ascendance. Ran on her feet right there. Belly to belly suplex. And then another one. Picking up. Oh, got behind her right there. And look at this. Roll up. 
and only a one count on that. What an event is sentence is gonna be. The fate of the SCW Championship. Inside a steel cage will run down. The sentence card following this match. There, another one, another shot right there. And now, there, now going to the top. Oh, dropped an elbow and missed. And now, Cypher's gonna take advantage here. I certainly think Cypher has all the abilities to be a top female performer here in SCW and SCAW but when there's only one women's championship among the performers here in SCAW female performers maybe they need a secondary title maybe tag titles be against it but oh and look at that through the ropes there. And now they're going at it on the outside. And they're back in. And uh oh, oh, nice reversal right there. This right. Hooks the leg. And, oh, grabbed the bottom rope there to get a break. Very resourceful. There's Lara Croft right there, and she'll need to be resourceful when she's in there with Sailor Moon. And she thought about maybe diving out, but didn't do it. Now, suplex her back into the ring. Knee, or well, maybe not a knee. Bow drop right there. And a near fall on that. Dropped her with the. Oh! It was that? It was like a Hadouken. What in the world was that? It was like a fireball? She should probably stay on Lara Croft here. And, oh, what a foot. That was a weird looking kick. And that, oh! Oh my goodness. She crashed and burned. And, oh, on the floor! Sit down, power bomb! That could be it. Just get her back in the ring. Get the pin. Now, I'll bring the knee up, up high right there. He's in control. The three-time former SCAW Women's Champion. And drops her. Got a drop kick right there. Schwip. Corner and again right there. Back comes Cypher here. For, oh, get, oh my goodness! Back dropped out, and that elbow! Oh my! Oh, oh, she missed. She went for high risk, and, and uh, 
Pierce, she badly timed that elbow. Gonna try take two now. Yes, she got it that second time. We could have edited that out, but nah, leave it in. Uh oh. Full front. Look at that. Oh my goodness! Ball game! What a move! That's it! And. Oh! Oh! Kicked out! I she kicked out of that. That was a impressive move right there, but. Seeing and see a cipher. It needs to. Oh, she might get her, you know! Oh, so close! Missed the kick right there. Larkoff comes back with a shot. But another, what is this, Street Fighter? Oh, yeah. oh, wait a minute. That could be the man! The man, Forest Rage! Guy on! In the middle of the ring! There may be no escape! Well, there's only one way to escape. Tap that hand on the mat! Looks like she's, is she tapping? The referee's saying no. She's trying to fight her way out. It looks like she's tapping, but that's not tapping. That comes... Or a crop. Oh, fall away slam! Shades of Scott Hall. And a roll up. Oh, look at this! She's got a roll up of her own here! And. Oh, man. Oh, my goodness. That was really close. And a drop kick in the, in the backside. And now. Oh, no. Two. Wait, it's reversed! She has her own... Her own move on her, the Tomb Raider pile driver! And only got two! Wow! We continue on. Another one. Now... Oh! Regal Cutter. And it's going to not get it either. We keep going. Markov is taking a ton of punishment. She's checking which direction to run. I'm sure Sailor Moon is watching. Well, she has a victory already over Saifa, it was a great matchup. Kick right there. This Larkoff looking past Saifa here. Back Russian leg sweep. And... Big back body drop! Another back Russian leg sweep. Nice power slam. One, two, and no, only two. Staying on. Oh, rolled out. Hangs the ropes right there. And oh, drop kick was missed. Back Russian leg sweep. Back Croft now. Looking to take control. He's got her up. For the ropes, what's she gonna do here? Can't, oh my goodness, what a throw off the top. What a throw off the top that was. Power 
power bomb. That's got to be it. And no, kicked out again. Wow. She's kicked out of a lot here. But so is Lara Croft. I was whipping the corner. Now, Cypher's going to try something off the top. It's like, man, oh, reverse the Rana. I was going to try a Rana, but Lara Croft was able to prevent it from happening. And now the Tomb Raider pile driver got it. Got the leg hooked here. Two and three, and that's the end. Tremendous matchup. Lara Croft was tested, but she is ready for Sailor Moon at Ascendance. What a match that's going to be. What an Ascendance, Ascendance is going to be. Let's run down the card for you. We are on our way to the Queen City. Crown of Ruler in SCAW. The Senate's, the SCAW Championship will be on the line. Plus we will challenge for the SCAW Championship at Blood, Sweat, and Tears 11. Steel cage match for the SCAW Championship. Superman gets another shot. We'll take on Dante. Can Superman dethrone? The current champion, or will Dante go to Blood, Sweat, and Tears 11 as SCW champion? Who will escape the cage or prevail in the cage? Be victorious. Sailor Moon will face Lara Croft. No one has beaten Sailor Moon in SCAW, but Lara Croft has all the abilities to perhaps be the first to hand Sailor Moon a defeat. And who's going to face Hellboy in Blood, Sweat, and Tears 11? Both these men want him. We'll have to fight through each other to get Hellboy and a shot at the streak at Blood, Sweat, and Tears 11. Culmination, the SCAW tournament. Eight are left. The quarterfinals, semifinals, and finals all will take place at Ascendance. Time the night is over. We will know who will be the number one contender for Blood, Sweat, and Tears. Captain America will face Brian Erlacher. These two tremendous athletes will do battle. Who will advance to the semifinals? The winner of this matchup will face the winner of the match between Aquaman and the SCW Internet Champion, the Angry Video Game Nerd. Both these men are fueled by anger and rage. And only one will have enough in the tank to get past each other, and then the winner is going to have to face either Captain America or Brian Urlacher. The other half of the quarterfinal bracket, William Wallace, faces the hardcore champion Casey Jones. These two men, popular superstars among the SCW fans. One of them, only one can get to the semifinals. And then it'll be Thor and Shazam, a rematch from Blood, Sweat, and Tears 9. They'll have to go through each other to get to the semifinals. In the end, only one of these eight men will be going to Blood, Sweat, and Tears 11.